Please be seated. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm afraid I haven't acted tonight in the modest way which is traditional for the accompanist. <laughs> uh, in fact, from time to time, I've had to ask myself the question, am I too loud? <laughs> but you know, of course, it's a moment of great pride for me that these three great singers should all appear on the same program, on the same platform, at the same time. <laughs> it's even a remarkable fact to find them all at the same time on the same continent, as a matter of fact. <laughs> but of course, I feel deeply the honour they've done me because I know they came and appeared here tonight out of affection for me. Yeah. Now there's a fourth person who has not appeared on the stage but who's very much a power behind the scenes and this is a man with whom I've been associated for 40 years. He conceived the idea of this concert. He labored mightily to organize it, and he devised the program. And now, of course, I'm referring to Walter Legg. And now I must thank you, because all through the concert, we up here on the stage have felt goodwill welling up towards us. And it's goodwill which I must say I have experienced from you for many years. And I'm deeply grateful to you all for the indulgence you've always shown me. But I have one more claim to make on your indulgence. It is this. There are hundreds and hundreds of people who will want to come backstage and see and greet Elizabeth. There are hundreds of people who will want to come and greet Victoria. There are hundreds of people who will want to come and greet Dietrich. There even may be a few people. <laughs> I was going to say there may be a few people who want to see the back of me. <laughs> but I must beg you, and I'm asked by the management and by the staff of this hall to beg you not to come round to the artist's room. Because if you did, these glorious singers who've been here this evening and have sung so marvelously and given us such enormous pleasure, they would be here till all hours of the night. And in fact, they would miss their last buses home. <laughs> On behalf of all those four people, Elizabeth Schwarzkopf, Victoria de Los Angeles, Dietrich Fischer-Diskau, and Walter Legg, I thank you from the very bottom of my heart for the wonderful evening you have given us. And I would like to say goodbye and express my thanks to you in this way.